Okay, so the next step is to download the MySQL Workbench. Very simple, again, just go to Google and type in MySQL Community Downloads. It will take you to this page. Once you, come, once you come here, click on Download. So you can click on Download uh, and then start clicking on No Thanks, just start my download. I have already downloaded this, but I'll still walk you through these steps. So I'm going to click on Save and then this uh, version is downloaded. I'm going to uh, open this. You get this, all you have to do is drag and drop this here. So simply drag and drop and once the installation is complete, you will see this, this icon, simply double click on this icon. Now when you double click on this icon, it recognizes your connection. So click on this and then type the password. This is the password that you uh, had set up when you were initially downloading or installing the MySQL server, not the MySQL workbench. So I'm going to type in here and click on OK. And once I do that, I get to see all these things. So I can go to queries and I can start writing my SQL queries and I can start writing, creating databases, tables and all the fun things as part of SQL.